I feel like this is going to be my death. I feel like I'm going to fall off here and die. Oh! Nope, I'm on fire. I'm on fire. I'm going to heal just to be safe. Perfect then. There you go. Another one for the dropout round. Ah! Are they hitting me with oil? Oh, are they trying to catch me on fire? Okay, we go short here. Thank you for the gifted sub, Firestorm. You're the best. Thank you. We have a mob here. Okay, you're dead. I need to bring out this rifle. Okay, you're dead. Let's see if we can do it. Rifle time. Oh my god. It's huge. It, it, I feel like it still shoots shotgun shots. Watch some of the free Game Changer episodes after you recommended it. It's great stuff. Oh, man. I only know Game Changer through YouTube Shorts. It's truly the best. Game Changer is so funny. Megan and I have watched every, uh, every episode. All right, so let's try this. I feel like this rifle is not what I thought it was. It's long. I thought it was going to be a... This is like a shotgun shot again. Chat, I just have to say, I'm having so much fun streaming Bloodborne right now. And I so appreciate the amount of restraint that you guys have shown and the lack of backseating and information that has happened in the chat. I appreciate you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. That's the repeater. How the fuck do people use this? Go, let's go. Okay. So long heavy barrel makes up in range what it lacks in reload speed. Blood attack is 23. Repeating pistol is 101. Hunter's pistol is 79. But I thought it was going to be more like a... Always happy to let you drown while not helping you at all, Ryan. <laughs> Thank you, Firestorm. Repeater, I hardly know her. I still am kind of under the impression... Maybe I could ask chat about this. I'm under the impression that... Blood attack of 23 has to do with how much each individual bullet hits for and not how much overall damage it puts out. Chat, am I correct in thinking that this blood tinge number for Ludwig's rifle and for the blunderbuss are per bullet or is that it's overall damage 23 that's overall fuck just so you hear it wax said there's oh you're good you're good warnings in india how close they are to you though yeah just trying to keep you safe sorry if this is annoying lol not annoying at all cj i appreciate you thank you and also whack thank you uh i'm keeping an eye on it uh I could probably keep a better eye on it, but I'll try and keep my phone up. Uh, that way I have a uh, better eye on it. No idea. I use guns as much as you. Okay. So then... Hmm. How the fuck do you make sense of this then? All right. I want to I want to try and learn a little bit more about these pistols. Uh, the short answer is we're like we're like semi close to indie uh, siege, but uh, 
we're all right for now. All right, I gotta figure out how this works. There's red right here. Why is this red? Also red there. Also things are making scary noises. Getting scaled. It's a path up here. There's a beastie. Okay, so let's use the repeating pistol now. You missed. How did you miss, Mark? 25 damage. Is it better from this far away? That's 40. That should be a visceral. The sound happened. Okay. I am much further from figuring out the truth of how these things work. <laughs> I mean, to me, it seems like the... Oh, hi, Mark. Oh, hi, Tub. How's it going? To me, it seems like the... Uh... Thanks for the five bits. To me, it seems like the debate on the, on the bullets is basically this. The debate on the guns is basically this. Like, on the one hand... The major gun, uh, the major gun plus side is the visceral attacks. As a complicating feature to that, you have the ability to suffer, sorry, to take damage to increase the strength of your bullets using that one thing, which I forget what it's called. Uh, so that can make them a little bit more effective. On the other hand, it really looks like you have to... Like, it's still melee combat and just sort of, like... Like, so I, I keep trying to figure out the role of the gun inside of melee combat. Only, it seems like, to allow viscerals and maybe to, like, provide finishing blows sometimes. I don't, I don't understand. Like, if they're super weak, you can hit them with that. So, a repeating pistol versus a blunderbuss... I'm guessing Ludwig's rifle versus Blunderbuss is it has longer barrel, and so the spread is tighter slash the damage fall off is lower. One of those two. But Blunderbuss versus pistol, like, repeating pistol has apparently 101 versus, 20 versus 27. Four times the damage, and yet it only does 40 if they're right up on me. And 40 is not a lot of damage. Ah, fuck. I'm trapped. Uh-oh. Let him cook, chat. I'm trying. I'm trying. I wonder if it's just one of those things where it's like, it's just going to be your offhand weapon. You're not ever going to use it for major damage. It's always going to be... Also, the other thing is that I have put no stats into... Maybe this is it. Maybe it's that I put literally no stats into Blood Tinge. That's probably it. That's probably it. Probably a good part of it is that I've put zero. I put zero. I have a nine for Blood Tinge. Probably a good part of it. I love the ex scientific experimentation. Well. Six damage, by the way. Good old Ludwig's pistol. I spent 10,000 on this shitter. Hi, weird guy. How's it going? What have I missed so far? Uh, well, we discovered the Forbidden Forest. What's this place called again? <laughs> That's a front seat question. Uh, the Forbidden Wood. Uh, we, these guys are dumb. They're just standing there, even though all of their friends have died. Yeah, we talked to Alfred and we got a, some better lore understanding, hopefully. Uh, we're attempting to piece together how guns work. Turns out left click to fire is mostly how it works. Ooh, is this the same door I was at earlier? Does not open from this side. No, different door. All right, cool. Good to know. Uh, didn't Forbidden Wood just sub? Wait, what? Did they follow or something? Was there an account? How are you today, weird guy? Okay. 
cursed beasts. This guy's got a gun. He's also got a little bit of a Willy Wonka fit going on, I feel like. I feel like at the end of all of that, all I want to do is go back to just wielding the long axe and going from there, right? And then occasionally getting some visceral in. And there's a good, a good chance to do it. Hi, friends. All right. We have 15K. I thought that was a chest at first, not a chest. Let's just go ahead and break all their barrels. All their household items. Fuck your household items. Blood vials. Are you going to stand up? Yes, you are. Pretty average day, I guess. Could be worse. Glad to hear that. Hmm. Oh, buddy, this place is long and winding. Okay. Okay. Secret here. Beast blood pellet. Finding lots of beast blood pellets here. Yay, destruction. Yay, destruction. Now, what is this room good for? Hold up. This room has nothing in it. Did I already loot it? No. Hmm. I feel like there's nothing in that room. You can't get lost in the forbidden woods. Bad news. Oh, sorry. You can't not get lost. Okay. Much better. Good news. I already did. Chad, I was listening to a, uh, I was listening to a, a different stream the other day. Ah! It's the fire. And, uh, they were asking a question that I thought was pretty interesting. And I want to, I want to present it here to you and hear what you have to say. The question was, what job title is the quickest red flag in a, uh, prospective date? Prospective date. What's the job title that a person has that you're like, uh-oh, yikes. Feel free to be uh, as cruel and ruthless as you can. Influencer? God damn. All right, well. Cruel and ruthless to other people. Other people. Oh, not me. OnlyFans model? Venture capitalist is so good. Timeshare salesman. Cop, cop, cop. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I guess we just got to run through here. I was kind of hoping we couldn't run through here. Please don't light me on fire. Please don't light me on fire. These are the these are the ones. No! Shit! I honestly, I don't want to. I don't want to brag, chat. That was our first death of the of the stream. We made it nearly two out. We made it an hour and a half without a death. So I was thinking, I was thinking, uh, maybe we'd get to the end and I'd have to gift ten subs. They have like a wreath on their door. I wonder if that's some sort of protection from a from anything. You know. Indigestion, the unkillable. We made it so far. Okay. I'm trying to see if there's any other secrets over here. Doesn't look like it. Well, we got to go get that 10K back. That 12K back. Yee! Are you carrying over the Hollow Knight thing? I don't know. I hadn't had a chance to... I hadn't had a chance to say yet to figure it out. If we make it through one entire Bloodborne stream without dying, I will give it subs. 
I'll do it. I think the odds are even lower than in Hollow Knight, and we only did it like once or twice in Hollow Knight, so. They forgot to take it down after Halloween. All right. Oh, what the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? Oh! It's a trap. Oh my God. <laughs> I kept running away from it left and right and left and right. It swung one way and I ran away and then it started swinging back and I was like, oh no. Damn, so we must have missed that the first time through. Wow, okay. All right, good to know. How do we get there quick, most quickly? Watch out for more traps, I guess. That was wild. Foul beast. Can I have some dogs? Dog time? Whew. Well, they won for intelligence, but a 20 for dex. I think they're hitting me with oil there. I think they're trying to set me. Yeah, they're setting me on fire with oil. Those are oil urns they're throwing. That does make sense. So don't get caught on fire. All right. Whatever happens, do not get caught on fire. We need to switch clothes so that we get this oil off of us. Are there more traps? Whew. Anyways, I think Hunter might be the biggest red flag. I think social media influencer or influencer is a pretty good one. Uh... This is why I'm bad at hot takes, because now I'm just thinking about all the jobs that like I wouldn't want to talk shit about just because it feel like it would make it would it would be a little bit mean, right? I don't want to be mean. What did people on the other chat say? Uh, they got off topic super quickly because one person said teacher and then they just roasted that person for 30 minutes. They just roasted that person for 30 minutes. They said teacher because they're never going to have any time for you. Because if they're a good teacher... And the, the reasoning in the end, I think, was, like, not crazy. They were like, if they're a teacher and they're good at their job, they're only going to care about... Like, they're going to spend so much time caring for these kids. And they're just not going to have the available time for you. Which is like, I, you know, I... Sure, there's something to that, I guess, maybe. On the other hand... Uh, this is a different way in, and I like this way better, but we need to get our, our echoes back. On the other hand, if we get our echoes back here, actually, we get our, we can afford Ludwig's sword. Um, they did just keep, they did just keep, like, roasting them about that. That can be said about all jobs? Uh, but, like, think about accountant, right? Like, I think you can be, like, I think teacher is one of those jobs where it is less simple than... Uh, an eight hour clock in, right? And I think that it is true that if you are a teacher uh, and you are good at your job, that there might be a sort of like, and that you're also a good person, that there's a, a certain bleed over that might not work, uh, work the same way, you know? Accountants work 20 hours during tax season. Okay, I guess what I'm saying is I don't think it is a straight up uh, every single job, the more you care about it, the more you work and the less time you'll have for other people. I think there are plenty of jobs where you can care about them plenty. They end at five o'clock and that's good, you know? Uh, I do think because of the nature of the work with teaching that a lot of times you end up taking more home with you in terms of emotional stuff. Uh especially if you work in, in certain places, like as a teacher, I think you end up taking a lot more concern home with you about your kids than otherwise. Uh, to be clear, I also want to roast this guy, the guy who said teacher, you know? I want to roast that guy. And of course it was a guy who said, I don't want to date a teacher because they're never going to have any time for me. Of course it was a guy.
Hi, Halbrod. How's it going? Okay, killed you. In terms of emotional stuff? I, yeah, I feel like, to me, it's like... Uh... That's the, at least at least the one interpretation I was coming up with. On the other hand, I do think like lawyer could be a red flag, right? Just because if you're a lawyer, like the idea is you're a hyper capable person, but you know. Same with doctors, professionals in that way. Hey, thanks, Ryan. Wait, are you a lawyer? Human trafficker's a red flag? That's a that's a pretty good one. That's a pretty good one. Yeah, yeah. If they're a human trafficker, that's a red flag. I will say, uh, the other thing I was thinking is, what jobs are less red flags? Oh my god, I did just roll over that. Wait a second. Chad, I just executed the first ever jump in uh, Bloodborne. Check it. Can't... Can't run over it? Can't run over it? Jump. Let's go. The other thing I was thinking is, there are a couple jobs that might seem worse on the surface, but they're less of a red flag. I think being a marijuana dealer, less of a red flag than some of the other jobs out there. <laughs> you know? Uh... Hi, hi, Aaron. How's it going? Oh, How you no. doing? Jumps are back. Jumps are back, baby. PTSD. They're back. I'm finding a way to jump in every game. All right, one of these fuckers has our blood echoes, and I don't know who it is. No, it's the ones all the way over there. Shit. <laughs> Exclamation zero. All All right, so the Molly situation here is bad. I wonder if there's a way to get up to them. What is making that noise? Oh, you? What's up? Did y'all ever find out about a very simple feature and get very excited? I just found one out for Premiere Pro and I'm far too excited. What's the uh, what's the feature, Dempsey? Yo, pie. How the fuck do I get up there? Hmm. Does this go here? Maybe? This is the part that's locked, right? It's not open from this side. What if I just swing my axe and tear down their house? Their whole house. I think I just have to run through here. A lawyer is not a red flag. You're helping people even if they aren't deserving it. That's unconditional love. I think that is a... Uh, I think that's possible for your, for a lawyer. I don't think that's at all required to be a lawyer. And I would say probably not even average to be a lawyer. I've got, to be clear, a lot of lawyer friends. Not a lot, but a couple lawyer friends. I've got family members who work in law. Uh, I've got two parents who work in law. I would not say... Uh, I would not say... A desire to help people that aren't deserving it is a, a necessary part of a law. Uh, I'm going to use a bold hunter's mark. For instance, most law is like... Like most law is, you know... So, so much of law is not like defending people who have been wrongly accused or defending people who did something and then regret it. Like... It's like all the complicated, you know, like family law uh, with the divorce. Uh, it's like tons of corporation, corporate law and, and stuff like that. Contract law, the types of law that are not uh, being a public defender. All right, we can buy the blade and I can't wait to see what this looks like. I absolutely have to buy the blade. Blade. If it's anything like the uh, the gun, then it maybe sucks, but we'll try it. I think we might also be able to get a single upgrade in level. Ludwig's Holy Blade. I can't wield it yet. Shit. I can't even wield it? 
Welcome. What is it? What is it you desire? Very I need well. skill me... of 12. I'm missing. No, I'm good. Just one skill. Thank God. We just got home with 30k. We did. We did not lose that 30k. Well, good hunt. And now. That's the wrong one. And now. Oh. Mark. Great sword. Let's go. This is my favorite weapon. Raise a hand in the chat if this is your favorite weapon. Mark's looking like a paladin. I'm a holy blade now. Oh, that's a good sound. Hey Ryan, I desperately need some positions today. I've lost like 15k shats on your previous beat runs, <laughs> and I really want them back. Fuck! Have some pity on a poor chat loser. Welcome uh, home, good hunter. I'll do my best, Firestorm. I don't have anything to predict desire? yet, I would say. I'm so sorry. First off, I'm Hunters so sorry. Hunters told me about the church. It's, I didn't mean about to! About the gods and their love. It was an accident. I do love you. I do love you. I do love you. This is the weapon I ended up using the most. Interesting. I mean, I can see the appeal here. Oh, that's a cool thing. That's so cool. Let's do the jumping attack like this one. Oh, that's my favorite move. Oh, we got a lunge. We got a swipe. We got a the overhead jump. Oh. So good. I can imagine really, really using the shit out of this. For now, I don't really think we can uh, afford to upgrade it, but... Uh, let's do the Forbidden Woods. I need to get past this part, so we're gonna, we're gonna sprint past this part. See if we can. Notice how when it's his spouse, he feels bad. Can I be honest with you? Can I be a hundred... Can I be entirely upfront and for real with you chat can i be entirely upfront and for real here's the thing i would not in any way shape or form feel bad about what we just did there with janice if i weren't streaming some moments when you are streaming just cause panic in you this more than they otherwise would one of those moments is the fear in my the fear that i felt was what if i just killed janice and what if chap saw me do it listen it's like no this is this is the opposite i'm not i'm i'm, I'm admitting to something worse tub in my mind in my mind, it's like this. It's like being caught masturbating versus like mas. Nope, that's uh, I probably shouldn't do that. Okay, well, it's it's like being caught. Um, how do I do this? It's like okay. I I need a new route to explain this. I need a new I need a new way to explain this. All right. If I'm just sitting at home, no one's watching, I accidentally hit Janice and she, and, and I'm gonna have a small moment of like, oh my God, is she okay? But I'm not gonna have a, oh my God, did my chat just witness me murdering my wife in this game and the most beloved character so far? And are they going to clip it out of context, make me look terrible for the rest of my life and never let me live it down? That's the difference in the panic. That's the difference. Ryan, no. cut, cut. cut, cut. Cut, cut. All right, the dog is chasing me. You know what? Perfect timing. Dog is chasing me. Here, take this. Nice weather. The damage is real low because I suck, but there's the blade. Murder's okay as long as no one sees it. Not like that. It's just that I... Dude. 
Thanks for all the bits today, guys. Holy shit. Okay, you should never... Okay, don't run into the fire, because I'm, I'm all covered in oil. Ryan's okay with murder so long as it's not seen. I thought that I could trust you guys to tell you this little factoid. I thought that it would be a relatable moment. You know? Instead, surprise, surprise, you're turning it against me. I thought it was an okay thing to admit to that I was most concerned because you were here. I trusted chat, and that, and that was my first mistake. It's red flags all the way down. He murdered a girl's dad so that he could take his clothes. They're incredible clothes. All right, let's see if we can get to the right immediately by just skipping all these people. Skip, 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 skip. That's the one I can't do. Are you happy you have us, Daddy? First off, I have to I have to reiterate, I am not Daddy in this situation. But I die. We run. Let's run. Despite what that command says, I am not dead. Okay. They're dead. Good to know. No more. No more. I will just have to get rid of that command, I think. I think people are just confused. I'll have to... I'll have to get rid of that command. Oh, somebody's whispering behind me. Okay, we do the big... Oh, let's try it with the axe. Let's try it... Or with the, with the sword. Let's try it with the sword. I don't give a fuck. You'll always be daddy for me since you... Right, but like my wife might give a fuck, you know? I think my, my wife might give a fuck. Why can't I do the overhead attack? I keep missing the overhead attack. What am I doing wrong with the overhead? Is it this one? Nope. Hmm. Nope. Okay. Slow, slow kills there. Slow kills. Cave in here. Glad we ran past that guy. I'm looking for more traps on the ground. Oh, yes. Let's unlock this shortcut. Fuck yes. Shortcut unlocked. I'm finally back. Why does the water look so cool? I think it's maybe because there's oil in it. That's what I was just sitting here thinking. It might be the, like, the, the, sheen, the sheen of oil. Yeah. Meaning those Molotovs might set the whole thing on fire, but not sure. Um. Okay. Hey! Getting shot by somebody too. It's looking even prettier than uh than oil should look. Yeah. It does look very pretty. Hello, friend. You're on the roof, and I'm underneath you. I'm under. Thank you for the five bits. Oh. I know what I need to do, but I'm not sure I have the strength to do it. Bye, Gothic. Thanks for being here. Have fun at work today. Good luck. Can we get a uh, a warm goodbye for uh, for Gothic? Bye. Got this blood vial. Honestly, we're kind of chilling through this part. This part is tough, but we're kind of, we're doing all right. Okay, this has nothing. There's that part up there, but it, I think we just had to run past it. There's definitely loot though. Fuck. How do I get to the loot? I don't want to die to the flames. I do want to get to the loot. Blood vial. What was that? Did I just see that? That shadow? Okay, is there a path over here? No. Nope. Oh, we're on fire! No! Okay. Ignore, the, uh, ignore this part. Maybe we'll come back around to it eventually. Oh, my God. Hi, Calliope. How's it going? We'll come back around to this part. Maybe eventually there will be a way to get on top of that bridge. 
but he's launching shit at me. That shadow was moving at 5 FPS. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. I'm happy somebody else saw that. I think we can break this. Hey, we can break that too. Any chests in here? Any chesticles, please? I would like some loot or some lore. One of the two. Chest, chest, chesticles. How are you, Calliope? Oh, okay. Don't know where you're shooting from. In there. Okay, I see now. And there's a big fucking bomb. I need to kill you. I'm, I'm almost dead. Kill you too. Okay, this part's going to be a little sketchy. We got 16,000 right now. At least the uh, the economy is bumping during this game right now. The economy is bumping. We have... Uh, we're getting much more blood echoes from enemies these days. We found the next place. We did. Hi, Haunted Adams. Welcome in. Doesn't that guy know that a... Uh, okay, we're looking for cover. We're looking for cover. Actually. Hello. Leave that cannon alone. I want to fire it. Uh, guy right there. Sure. Oh, hello. Those are the weapons that really hurt. I hate those weapons. Rally, rally, rally! Okay. Woo! Ryan, no offense, but even if there was a chest there, you wouldn't see it for at least two more streams. I am a truly... Ah! Camera! I'm truly trying my best to see shit now. I know that I was blind at one point, but now I see. My days are so much better when I can catch a stream. That is so kind of you. I don't know that we deserve that, but I'm happy to hear it. Uh, okay. All right. All right. No chests. I just want to confirm. No chests. Common from soft camera W. Now, if this is anything like the... Uh, Hemwick Charnel Lane. Here's what we know about about this about this Forbidden Wood. It, it goes to Bergenverth College. We already have the password. Chat. What was the law? Oh man, does anyone know off the top of their head what the? You know that like library room on the way up from Daddy Gascon, from Odin Tomb to Cathedral Ward. There is a note there about Bergenverth, and I think the Bergenverth spider. Does anyone know off the top of your head what that, or is anyone willing to look it up, what that dialogue says, what that note says? That's the only other thing I can think of with Bergenverth, other than what Alfred has told me. Ryan, you know you're a breath of fresh air in this noxious world? Aw, that's sweet of you. I'm just out here trying to have fun. Trying to brighten some days, maybe. You're sweet. Uh, Bergenverth spider hides all manner of rituals and secrets. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Keeps our lost master from us. A terrible shame. It makes my head shudder uncontrollably. So it's possible Master might mean Master Logarius as well. Maybe not. That's the Master we've heard about recently. I'm guessing we're going to have a boss. Oh, shit. This is it. Boss battle? Nope. Okay. There's an enemy over there. Okay, I thought we were descending into a place with a boss battle for sure. There's some deep, deep breathing in here, and I'm also getting worried about traps. The winds are howling. 
Oh, Ryan, you know you're a nerd? I do know I'm a nerd. All right. Bad news, Tub, you're also a nerd. The fuck is this? We're staring off into the deep distance. I feel like I shouldn't jump down there. Okay. It's really dark. I'm getting very nervous. Oh. Least windy day in Chicago right here. It's also giving me the uh, gravity room vibes. With all the like secret jumps and stuff. Hey, also spider webs? Uh oh. Bergenworth spider? Maybe? The wind stopped just as suddenly as it started. Super realistic. Okay. I'm noticing spider webs for the first time. What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? What is that? What is it? What is it? I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Okay. Oh! oh, God, they retracted inside of his head. Oh, shit. Oh. That's Medusa. That's a great, that's a great one. Medusa right there. Medusa. It sounds like you're a redneck saying Medusa. <laughs> Medusa. Cheers, weird guy. Wasn't very friendly of you. If that enemy was friendly, then I will eat my hat. If I fucked up and I just killed it before it was going to come up and like give me an item or give me some lore or talk about how our days were going. I'm getting nervous that this one is also going to have snakes coming out of its head. No! Is it gonna do it? No! Fucking shit! I don't like it! Oh, God. Oh. Getting scared. I'm getting scared. Can be worse. You could be stuck on a plane with him. Okay. Check your corners before you walk out for sure. Is this a new kind of elevator? Okay. Maybe it's an elevator. I can't tell. gonna break some barrel oh buddy I actually watched Pulp Fiction again recently what'd you think Haunted Adams I watched it a uh, couple years ago with Meg on Halloween no idea why I convinced her I don't think she had a very good time and that's fair honestly it's not Megan's type of movie okay all right all right all right Getting a wee bit. See, this looks like the elevator. Does this take me to where I just was? Maybe? No, this is a different elevator. Shit. There's loot right ahead, which makes me feel like I'm going to get attacked. Hello? Hello? Is that a cane? You're a hunter, right? Are you a friend? 
Can we talk? Ah, a new Yo, he's face, spiffy. A new face, and an accomplished hunter. Hunter would appear. <laughs> I am Volta, master of the league. Members of the league cleanse the streets of all the filth okay. that spread about during the hunt. Like any half decent hunter ought to, you know? Haven't you seen enough of these wretched beasts, freakish slugs, and mad doctors? Sentence these fiends to death with the help of your league confederates. What do you say? Why not join the league? Oh. The League of Extraordinary Gentlemen. I'm here to join the League of Extraordinary Gentle Persons. I'm here. I'm here to do it. I don't know shit about you, Walter. Walter? Uh, which leads me to believe that I'm just going to join without questioning. Yes. I don't know shit. I don't know a, a reason hunter, not to. well should. Commit the start. Our own Carol Rune. Ooh. Symbol of the League. Impurity, uh-oh. The night dark. brims with defiled scum and is Ooh. permeated by their rotten stench. I like it. Just think, now you're all set to hunt and kill to your heart's content. Hunt in cooperation That's with That's kind of what I've been doing. Your league confederates. Confederates, sir. <laughs> See, now you use the word confederates, and now I'm a little bit concerned that I, I jump into something that I don't want to jump into just based on your apparel alone. Um, also, what's going on with your head? One eye? No, there is one thing you must know. I should have read what the rune, the rune says. By the of the League, those who bear its rune will see vermin. Okay. Vermin writhe deep within all filth and are the root of man's impurity. All vermin are to be crushed. Vermin are the root the of impurity? exists to expunge all vermin ridding us of any trace of human corruption and so until we are rid of all vermin you must continue to okay. hunt and kill so we have a special this rune fate is ours alone do not expect the world to grasp our work but remember the confederates will always have my blessing and each other Always. Interesting. Interesting. So they have their, they have a special rune that I think is going to allow us to see something invisible. Symbol of the League Oath. Ooh, and we have... It's behind my camera, but right here, we have a special colored slot for a rune. I'm guessing that maybe means we have, like, faction uh, runes. Like, these, these ones might be factions. A carol rune transcribes in human sounds. This rune discovered inside the forbidden beast... Inside the forbidden beast eater? Came to symbolize impurity and the oath of the League. Confederates of the League cooperate with hunters from other worlds and hunt to discover vermin. Vermin writhe within filth and are the root of man's impurity. Crush all vermin without hesitation. I kind of think it's going to allow us to see enemies that we might not otherwise see, but I'm not sure. Bloodborne ignited my love for calling things vermin. So metal. Also the word writhe. Writhing. All right, one more time. The League exists to expunge all vermin, ridding us of any trace so, of human corruption. getting rid of vermin, and but then... So until we ridding us of the trace of vermin, human corruption you must continue to hunt and kill i want to put it on but this i can't until we get fate home is ours alone sure sure okay walter uh you seem very intense like you seem like real intense you seem like you have exactly one hobby oh fuck
Fuck me. Uh... Boo. <laughs> Okay, so this is where we started. So fantastic news. We get to go back. And then we get to go home. Uh, we can tr we can try putting this uh, this thing on. This uh, this rune on. Uh, no, we're playing offline. Uh, Road Racer. Woo! All right. That is the interesting thing there, is it did have a... Uh, speaking of that, it did have a... Uh, a part of that description of the rune might be that like you can it said other worlds of course hunters from other worlds hunt to discover vermin so i think it might be related to online play we'll try putting it on either way also we have twenty thousand uh echoes again so uh that's cool all right let's put it on and see if it actually helps us like see anything um also with this we should probably buy something welcome home good hunter what is it you desire i think i can get at least one level and close to a second one Very so i could probably well. afford let the echoes become your strength and then we'll go back let me stand close now shut your eyes now shut your eyes oh <sighs> all right um Let's see here. I think we're going to want to upgrade something here. Uh, but we're only going to be able to afford one until we get a second one. Uh, until we use some infected cold blood. So I'm starting to question my, my decision to just uh, upgrade. <laughs> Strength and vitality. The good news is any of these upgrades bump up my physical defense the same. So that's not a concern. Physical defense just goes up no matter what you choose. Arcanus for loot, I feel fine about our loot currently. It's easy for us to get blood echoes, so I'm not super concerned about that. We could go up with skill and make this second... Uh, attack better? No. All right, so hold up. Give me give me 2 seconds. I need to think through this out loud. If I bump up strength, that increases my primary weapon attack by 3 and my defense by 3, but that's for everything. My secondary attack by 1. Skill does less than that. It only gives 1 to each. However, we know that skill is needed to we, we assume that skill is needed to wield uh, higher level, like not higher level, but like higher rarity, I guess, uh, items like Ludwig's sword. We needed higher skill. And frankly, maybe higher uh, guns too. I'm not sure. But to me, skill is unlocking higher level items, basically. The problem is I don't currently see any reason to do that. Endurance is the other one. It gives us more stamina. It does also give us poison resistance and rapid poison resistance, which I had not paid attention to, which is the only thing that upgrades our poison resistance. Okay. So I guess there's that. I'm also thinking more stamina might let us do more, uh, like longer spin attacks and or... I haven't really been paying attention to how stamina affects our... I'm going to do at least one stamina. How endurance affects our ability to do our heavy attacks, but we do a lot of heavy attacks. Let's do a little bit of blood echoing, and then we'll see. Actually, let's just... Uh, let's just practice. So if I do this one, that uses my entire stamina. That uses a little bit of stamina. Then when I run out, we have to sit... Nope.
I, I guess I'm not sure what stamina is actually going to be useful for. I just bought it. Yeah, just a heads up. We are not giving any information about what these things do. This is the part of the blind playthrough where these are rhetorical questions like Tom Chamos just said. These are no backseating. Please don't tell me what more stamina does. Uh, these are rhetorical questions. I'm just working through stuff in my head. Thank you. Uh... All right, I need like a thousand more, potentially fifteen hundred more to do one more level. So here's what I'm thinking. I'm not sure what stamina does. If this attack uses all of it, no matter what, maybe it gets stronger. But you can also do it with less than a full green bar. You can do it with any amount of green bar. I don't know if it affects the rate with at which it recovers. I think it's just the max. I've also never seen this personal effects thing before either. Interesting. Interesting. So maybe we could put hand lantern here. Oh. Yeah. Okay. We just learned something that is not at all related to what we... <laughs> we just learned something not at all related to what we were planning on uh, learning here. Let me put the hand lantern here. Let me put the music box here. That way I can take them off of my hot bar for... I could probably even put the monocle there. We'll leave monocle here for now. Um, that's the wrong button. Shit. Stamina is necessary to perform various actions. Depletes as actions are taken, but refills automatically. Chat, I have a front seat question. So I'm trying to I'm trying to piece this together. Holy shit. Hello, Insomnia says it's 8.40 p.m. here and I'm falling asleep on my phone watching the stream. I guess those last few nights of insomnia are catching up to me. Living up to your name today, Ello. Here's my question. Uh, does the amount of stamina that I have affect the damage that I do with attacks? Yes or no? I'm doing my best here, Dime. <laughs> exactly. When I ask a question, uh, I try and make it super specific and ask for what kind of answers we're asking for. No, it does not. Okay. Does the amount, second question, does the amount of stamina that I have determine what attacks I can make? Yes or no? There's a small delay. I'm wondering if this is a... Uh... Does the amount of stamina that I have determine what attacks I can make? Yes or no? Raising unclear. Weird question. Cool. That's fine. Thank you. Huh. I know I run fast and then I stop sprinting. I know rolling takes some. But it also comes back really quickly when I'm just... And I can basically still roll there. It's just a little bit delayed. I don't know if I know what the fuck stamina does. I'm sort of more confused than I started. Okay. Front see me. Uh, this one I'm looking for, oh, how do I phrase this? You know what? I'm going to do this in a safe way. I'm going to do this in a safe way. <laughs> this is not a front seat question. I think the safest way to do this, hey, Chamos, would you mind answering me, uh, based on what I know right now, like the, the type of actions that I can take in the game? What is stamina good for, for me? It affects my rolling around and my running. What else does it affect? Sorry, Chad, I just picked Chamos because Chamos is here right now. 
One more time. What is, uh, based on like what I know right now, what is stamina you, like, I guess I'm asking what would up, what would upgrading my stamina do for me? Based on the attacks and stuff I have right now, the weapons I have right now. I talked over you, Ryan. I'm sorry. You're totally good. You're totally good. I'm hitting a, 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 a dead end right here, and I'm trying to, like, what are the pros of upgrading stamina is, I guess, what I'm asking. Uh, just ask in Shamos right now, uh, Ojas. Thank you, though. The Vegas terms, it'll give you more flexibility in combat. Also, run longer like you figured out earlier. Okay. Sweet. I guess I need to start paying attention to my stamina during combat. And I think that's where I'll leave it right now. And we'll get back to this conversation. I'm literally writing it down as a question. What the fuck is stamina used for? All right. Thanks, chat. Thanks for bearing with me not knowing. What the fuck is stamina? And basically what I'm trying to figure out is like... We're going to leave that there. We're going to leave that there. Thank you guys, chat. Uh, but basically, so, so I can like try and clue you in. Basically, what I'm trying to figure out is like... Not what is stamina good for, but like... What is not having stamina bad for? Like, it seems like there's a cost to not having stamina, but I don't know what it is. And I'm going to figure that out. Stamina good for. All right. We'll figure that out another time. Uh, sweet. So we have this upgrade. Let's go back to the, uh, the Forbidden Wood. No, that was just a, a rhetorical question. We're done with the front seat. Done with the front seat. On to new topics. Thanks, chat. Thanks for, uh, thanks for bearing with my, uh, painful, painful ignorance. I appreciate you. Thank you. All right. So we have a shortcut through here. There's the crows. Fuck you, crow. I'm just watching my stamina bar like a fiend. Hello, uh, Valter. We can use this to turn our hand lantern on, which is which is handy. Oh. Chat, what should I have for dinner tonight? Megan's at work. I, uh, what should I have for dinner tonight? Oh shit. What am I doing? I still have 11,000. Oh, I was going to spend those. Fuck. That's right. I was, I was so, I was spending so long trying to figure out what to spend it on that I didn't, uh, I didn't come up with, uh, I didn't actually spend it. I need to use that. Uh, pasta a la vodka? You ask as if there's not a good chance it's pizza? Okay, so, to be clear, I'm 89% sure that I'm gonna have pizza. But, on the off chance that I'm not gonna have pizza, what should I have? Carly says roasted veggies. I'm glad you think so highly of me. Quesadillas? Quesadillas. Okay. We kill you. We get to like 12,000 echoes. We're chilling. Now I'm rich. Also, give me your blood vials. Shower pizza. Nice big burger. What do you like on a burger, uh, Shelly? What do you put on a burger? The Bastard of Loran. I think that just said something about an infant. I forgot that last last episode we were gonna kill a child. Welcome home. What is it? Uh, I Very want to well, upgrade, me... but I don't know if I want to upgrade my endurance because I don't know what this shit does. Other than my resistance, which does seem powerful. Um, I'll do strength once more. Ooh, oh well. Oh well. It's like, I feel like I have an understanding of every item other than stamina. And I may have the wrong understanding of all of those different items, but I think I understand. Arcane is how well you loot. Blood Tinge is uh, the like power of blood-tinged weapons, which I think is basically guns. 
Um, vitality is or, uh, is HP basically. Uh, skill is what level of weapon. My current hypothesis is what level of weapon you can use basically. Um, just don't get stamina yet. Other than the ability to run longer, which is powerful. A hunter must hunt. Hi, in my trolley. How's it going? Also, I kind of want to jump down. Now that I have no echoes, I kind of want to jump down. That doesn't look super far, right? I'm going to try it. That's far enough. Okay, well, gravity. Oh, sevens. Don't let the intrusive thoughts win. Too late. 